Hi people. Uh, I think I could make it with just two videos. That one I did before that is outside. I couldn't make this one either. It's still daytime, so apparently and the other windows are open, so apparently it's taking enough lighting. Uh, you see, this one is just plain water. I I scraped the bottom and I put it in just plain water. You see there, plain water. It says that it takes a month or two until you start seeing the difference. So anyway, something's gonna indicate with this part up here, the flower, if they dying or not. So here it goes. Uh, I could not leave it over seven days because of mosquito problems, but I could take it in six days and rinse it out and put some more fresh on alcohol water. Um, not on alcohol. On Clorox water. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking of. Okay, I don't drink from case. Um, okay, this is it. And then we have this one. I don't know if you see the pellets in the bottom. That's Miracle Grow. I put a little bit of it. I don't know. Maybe it'll fix the problem. And maybe it'll. I scraped the bottom also of this one. So I'm going to see if it grows with a little bit of Miracle and some water. So fresh um, on the little bit of Clorox water. Okay. So this is how it's going. Look how beautiful the flower is. This is my daughter gave it to me the day before yesterday. I got shocked. I say, you bought me a, a, a rose bouquet? Nah. You know, usually she brings me a bag of potato. She does give me these kind of beautiful things. Like in Christmas time, you know, Mother's Day, my birthday. But out of, out of nothing, out of no birthday, no Christmas Day, no nothing, uh, show up with these beautiful bouquets. It was very exciting, you know. So I'm trying to save them, you know, somehow. Because I want to keep it as a surprise, you know. So I think it's a very beautiful bouquet. And you got this here. Also an experiment. Because the one outside. And let me see if I can reach this. Oh, God. Hold on. Uh oh. What did I do? Oh, no. Okay. Hey, give me one little. I'll let you see the flowers. If I do this. Okay. Anyway. You get the idea. Okay, here. Wait. Here. Okay. Here you see these seeds. These are what they call mini, mini watermelons. I took out the seeds. I planted some already. And I took out the seeds here so it could dry up. And maybe I could save them. Uh, they say it's a good thing now. You know, to these watermelons. So I tasted them. They are great. You know, so I got them here because if I leave it on the table, they might get confused for junk and they just throw it out. So I just have it here all with my plants. And I already told the family, don't touch that. That's my experiment here. So um, that's um, mini watermelons. This is the rose that I'm saving. These are the cuttings and the ones outside that I did in the first, the other video is also part of the cutting. But that one is on dirt. So, they all got scraped. I think this one I didn't scrape. I don't know. I don't remember. But this one is scraped. And the one that I planted is also scraped. And then, let's see what happens. Because this is my next experiment. I want to see if I could grow these um, watermelons. They don't hardly have no seeds. They're very little bit. Little small white seeds. So, let's see what happens with them. Will they grow? Won't they grow? That's the question. But I already planted some outside. So, let's see if it grows. Okay, that's all for now. God bless you and hope that my one of the, that my experiment experiment works. Okay, bye-bye.